32 people have been killed and about 159 injured in clashes between armed groups in Tripoli since dawn on Saturday. This occurs at a time when Abdul Hamid Dubeiba, the leader of the Libyan government of national unity, has declared his intention to call elections in the nation. For its part, the United Nations Support Mission in Libya expressed serious concern over the ongoing armed clashes in civilian areas of Tripoli and demanded an end to them. The latest clashes in Tripoli were allegedly started by Bashar aligned fighters, opening fire on convoy in the capital, while other pro Bashar units had gathered outside the city, according to the Baba's Government of National Unity, which was put in place as part of the United Nations led peace process following a previous round of violence. Bashar claims that the government of national unity's mandate has run out. He is supported by the Libyan parliament and military strongman Khalifa Haftar, who is based in the east. However, he has not yet been able to assume office in Tripoli, because the Beba has voted to only agree to give up authority to an elected government. So 